Often, reality show reunion episodes are boring formalities in which cast members perfunctorily bring viewers up to speed on what's happened in their lives since filming ended. But that was not the case with the Love is Blind Season 2 reunion. Sheikh Chatterjee came out guns blazing on the special, and many viewers noted that he seemed agitated from the very beginning of the episode, as though something had happened before the cameras started rolling. Of course, Sheikh had already developed a reputation as the season's number one villain, so it makes sense that he would be on the defensive going into the day. But Sheikh says it's not the response from viewers that had him on edge, but the behavior of his own castmates. As you're probably aware, Sheikh's comments about Deep Dee Vempati and his complete lack of attraction to her earned him a great deal of criticism. Much of that criticism was deserved, as the man really could not shut up about how unattractive he found his fiance. But Chatterjee insists that he was on good terms with all of his co-stars until they realized how he was being perceived by fans of the show. Sheikh has launched a new podcast called Life is Blurry, of course, and in his first episode, he spoke with 90 Day Fiancé star and farts in jars entrepreneur Stephanie Maddows about the way in which he was betrayed by his castmates ahead of the reunion. Did I seem a little like, aggravated at the reunion? I was, Chatterjee told Maddows. I was so hurt and upset by how everything happened, he continued. Everybody was just like, oh, you're the villain. All right, peace, dude. We don't want to be friends with you, Sheikh went on to claim that the entire cast was so, so obsessed with their own image. He insisted that they didn't want to be associated with him not because of his behavior but because of the manner in which he was falsely portrayed on the show. That was hurtful to me. And it made me lash out, he explained. I mean, I said a lot of accurate, true things. But the way I said it was, as, a man that was hurt and lashing out, in a recent interview, Sheikh claimed that he was peacefully hanging out with several of his castmates, including Deep Dee. Just days before the reunion was filmed, less than a week before the filming of the reunion, I was watching the Super Bowl with Deep Dee, Vempati, Shane, Jansen, Kyle, Abrams, if you had all these things to say, why don't you say it to me then, he told us weekly. Some people, I was like, I was there for you, man. I was there for you for a lot. Like Shane. I loved him and I felt betrayed, so, Sheikh decided to launch his own podcast in order to tell his side of the story. Chatterjee famously remarked that love is blurry, as opposed to blind, during the reunion episode, but apparently he couldn't use that as a title due to copyright issues. Sheikh went on to explain that the issues were a blessing in disguise as life is blurry is actually a more accurate title. It actually lends itself nicely because my podcast isn't just about love, he told his listeners. There's a lot of things that are confusing, unclear, foggy, blurry, he continued. But, the more you look at them, the more you learn and your opinions change. So to me, this is an opportunity to really talk about not only love, but finances, modern dating cancel culture, sex work, because these are all blurry topics, and apparently, so is Sheikh's reputation. Although dude really didn't have to tell the whole world that he thought Deepti was ugly. That SHT was just uncalled for.